I'll be presenting today's Radiopedia.org case in radiology, Median Arcuate Ligament Syndrome, or Dunbar Syndrome. Case courtesy is demonstrated here, and the case link is in the description below. Presentation, we have a 20-year-old female who presents with chronic epigastric pain, worse postprandial, and weight loss. Here we have the Doppler ultrasound. We note on the expiratory exam that there's a velocity of 162 centimeters per second. During inspiration, the following features are evident. There's an increased systolic velocity and an increased end diastolic velocity. There's also an increased celiac artery compression, which is noted by indentation of the upper aspect of the artery. There's also a large deflection angle between inspiration and expiration. Taking a look at the CT with contrast, this was taken in the mid position between inspiration and expiration. We note that there's asymmetric stenosis of the celiac trunk due to compression of the superior aspect of the artery by the arcuate ligament. There's also post synodic dilatation. The following should be considered if celiac artery compression syndrome is suspected. For one, it's a rare condition. In this case, it's presented as chronic postprandial abdominal pain. There was narrowing of the celiac trunk at the diaphragm. However, this is nonspecific and can commonly be seen in asymptomatic patients. Therefore, imaging findings should be correlated with the clinical history. Treatment is with surgical decompression and for this patient, laparoscopic surgical decompression was performed with symptomatic improvement after surgery. 